uh, guys, congratulations on the show. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Do you guys remember the first time you saw or read Lord of the Rings, where you were? Were you at school or did you see it in the cinema? I read it, I read it to my daughter when she was little mm. and I'd read it before that and I've read it two more times since being in this show. <laughs> so I've read it a lot. Um, I, I got about halfway through with, with my daughter and she said, how long is this? <laughs> and she was four. So, uh, no, I, 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 I spent a long time in this world, so um, it was great to be part of it. It's a, it's a huge show as well. I mean, there's a lot of um, CGI, but it's a very practical show as well. Did that help you guys when you step into the world and that you're really stepping into the world rather than being surrounded by green screens? Yeah, very yes. much so. I think even, you know, we were saying earlier that even even when we did have green screens, so much of it was practical because the crew were just so amazing at making sure that everything was was set up for us so that we didn't have to imagine too much. Mm -hmm. so it was there, we could just react. Um, so I think that was really amazing, actually. And um, and also a lot of our, a lot of the world of the Halfwits was shot on location. So that was also another kind of, we were very fortunate to have that, so yeah. yeah. We were in the woods, we were in, we're in the trees farms. and grass and mud. All mm. sorts. Yeah, we got to see so much of New Zealand that and not even like tourist attractions because it would just kind of be someone's farm. Yeah. So you got to see like really random bits <laughs> in New Zealand That's that so true. you and never would have even known was there. And mm. all the drivers knew everything about what they kind did. of tree yeah, that was did. or what kind of bird that was. It was yeah. extraordinary, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. I get the sense from you guys as well because you're in the, in, the, in the show with quite a community that you've become quite a community. Was that, did that make it even make it easier because of obviously you were dealing with the COVID protocols as well as making the show that you've all become a, a quite a close-knit family now? Yeah, yeah, very, very much, much so. so. Uh, in terms of uh, us in the foreground, it was wonderful because we all kind of liked each other. And so we tried to have dinners. We'd go to mm. somebody's for Sunday dinner and we'd talk and these guys would be improvising in the street, apparently. <laughs> um, but mm. uh, my big thing was just loving hearing the people who do background action, the other players. In, in their tent singing. Every time we walked past, they'd be yeah. singing some song. Yeah. So the, there was a real unity on set and in between takes, they'd start singing. Yeah. And, I, and I would try, we'd all join in actually. It was great. So we, we there was a lot of love going around. Yeah, yeah I just spoke to some of your co-stars and they, one of them was saying about how they, everyone, he was trying to get everybody hyped up by chanting and oh, doing yes. all these different <laughs> things. Dylan, that... Dylan, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It sounded like a lot nice. of fun. Did, yeah, he get you, did he get you guys going as well? He, oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. There yeah, was a yeah, lot yeah. of that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, and obviously you're dealing with a, a huge show. What was the kind of the hardest thing that you guys had to do? Was there a hardest scene that you had to do? Or did you find it, it was quite liberating to do something like this? That's, you know, a bigger a bigger deal than you maybe you're used to? Yeah, I mean, definitely yeah. all of those things are, I think, amalgamated together. Um, so many scenes that sort of are, are tricky practically to do with scale or to do with what the location is or what, what the set looks like and, you know, what is demanded of yeah. you. Uh, but then also what's demanded of you as an actor as well and sort of emotionally in those levels and where that takes you. So every day mm. it was there was a lot. But, I mean, having that sense of community, mm. it was so important and, it, you know, it really did sort of help drive us. I think we tried to watch out for each other, didn't we? You know, yeah, some things where we'd say... Yeah. There, there were some days where we literally said, can we work on this a bit because we want to help you you to make it the way we want it, you want it to be. Yeah. And so we'd actually start not improvising, not changing it, but we'd just try and get there yeah. together. And it was, I felt that was a, I've never seen that on a set before. Mm. There was a real sense of unity in terms of trying to make it the best it could be. And I, I've done so many, I've sent to some of the guys, well, I've done so many of these press junkets and doing the premieres that sometimes when you speak to the people, they haven't actually seen the finished product. They've been part of it, but not seen it. Yeah. Mm. Some of the guys said they've seen it, have you guys seen it? And as, as everything that you've done come to fruition as it as it surprised you that the show has been mm. yeah we've seen um the first three episodes as a cast i haven't seen anything um, i've seen all the trailers i stood in piccadilly circus and watched three quarters of the show <laughs> on the big thing on the big and i haven't seen it i've just been watching the trailers and, going, and the trailers keep finishing where's the rest of that scene i'm, I'm that That's guy <laughs> But I do love it, and I do think the evocation of the worlds, uh, and you know, because we were just half we were in the woods for all of our filming. So to see Numenor and to see you know Morvith swimming under a giant creature, oh, we're kind of like, what? Yeah, that happens. We were just in the woods eating big apples. Would this, this is happening? <laughs> watching Ishmael 
fighting. It's just glorious. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah I, I mean, it's it's all the hard work, all of those boys going training, mm. all of that kind of mm. dialect work. Yeah. I think it's paid off. Absolutely. I'm so excited for you to see yourself in yeah, that. I can't wait. Oh my goodness. I can't wait. Uh, guys, thank you so much for your time. Absolutely thank nice you. talking to you. Thank, thank you so much. You. Cheers. Thank you. thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, yeah. Is that from the Goonies? It is indeed. Yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.